Here we go, the 97th, 98th, and 99th country San Marino, Monaco, and Andorra. So in the summer of 2018, my elder sister came to Italy to join me for about like three weeks trips.、Um, she was traveling with suitcase. I was traveling, of course, with my backpacks. She was very caring and always thinking to help me with my smaller backpack. She bring me a full suitcase of food from Hong Kong. I was in charge for the travel information, and she was in charge of my stomach. We were doing, you know, makeup、uh, during our train trips. And、uh, eating snacks on board, cooking rice with our main rice cooker on board, and chatting. So from five star hotel to hostel bunk bed and couch surfing, we tried all different kind of accommodation. She's not accompanied me to grab, but also to travel as well. After visiting Milan and Venice, we took train to Rimini and changed the bus from there to San Marino. We stayed in a hostel in San Marino, which was located upstairs of a bar. So when we first arrived there, we felt confused. The next day, we stored our luggage in the hostel and then we went out for sightseeing. San Marino was a, a tiny and ancient place. It was located up to the mountain, up and down. We climbed to the mountain tops, get to see the whole view of this miniature com-、um, country, and then, of course, including in the Namur Castle, where the castle.、Uh, we only. Spent、uh, in San Marino for a day, and then we left、uh, San Marino. Oh, heading to Florence. We stayed in Florence for a few nights, and after that,、um, we moved to Pisa on the Cinquante.、Uh, when we finished our trips in Italy, we took train to Nice, France. We stayed in the hostel for the first night, and then、um, unfortunately I got bad, bad bug bite. But my sister was totally fine, though we were staying in the same room. So the next day we moved to a hotel for a better sleep,、um, and then we took a train from Nice to Monaco for a day trip. We walked around the Monaco play. Palace and get to see the view of the Monaco port. You know there was, there were few of like sailing boat. We left Tunis and heading to Toulouse, where was the first city I learned to travel independent. We stayed at my friend Theo, who I met in Berlin. He offered his、uh, whole rooftop apartment to my sister and me. Himself stayed with his girlfriend in another place. My sister、um, cooked Chinese food for them, and then after eating, four of us went to a local bar, and they, there was like live music performance. Next day, we just decided to stay in Toulouse and just chill. Um, after that,、uh, we stored our luggage at Tia's place and then took a minivan to Andorra. Considering、uh, Andorra will be my 100th country, so on the way to Andorra, there were like so many pictures in my mind about traveling around the world in these years, and、uh, I couldn't help to had tears fall. Um, while with like the countryside ups、um, and down mountain curly road,、um, I arrived、uh, Andorra with a full of tear face. 
So we stayed in a Zenit diplomatic hotel.、Um, in winter, Andorra is the ideal place for ski, but we were there in the summer. So in other season, Andorra is the shopping paradise for Spanish people because it's tax-free place. Even Tio asked me to buy cigarette for him,、uh, since it, that will be cheaper than in France. But but for visitor, they have like limited、uh, um, purchasing.、Um, after visiting Andorra on the way back to Toulouse, so we just left、uh, the Andorra border and、um, back to France. And my sister told me she left her wallet underneath the pillow in the hotel of Andorra. So there was cash and documents inside the wallet. I called the hotel immediately, asked them to check it. I used to handle this kind of、uh, things in my previous trip, for example in Armenia, in Nagara Karabakh. So the hotel replied me and told me they found the wallet. But I didn't tell my sister since I wanted her to learn from her careless experience, and、uh, a little bit worry. So after we、uh, returned back to Toulouse, and my sister took the same mini van back to Andorra in order to get her wallet back. I didn't go with her since my motion sickness. So I decided to stay in Toulouse, waiting her to come back. So smoothly, my sister came back to、um, the hotel in Andorra and got her wallet back. Though she lost some of her cash,、um, but luckily, all the documents were there. And、um, so I think that's、uh, already good enough. And she stayed in Andorra that night and.、Um, This was the first time we were being separate in this Euro trip, so I was frankly、uh, still got a little bit worried about her until she came back to Toulouse. So sometimes we were much more independent than we thought.、Um, before visiting like 100 countries, no,、um, after. To lose, we left、uh, and、uh, went to Bordeaux and Paris. And my sister ends up、uh, her Euro trip in Paris and flew back to Hong Kong from Paris. And then I continued my journey to do my second、uh, trips in West Africa. So before I traveled to 100 countries, I was always thinking to travel as much as possible. But after I, I traveled to more than 100 countries. I made up my mind to travel every country in the world. Why not? So now I still got fifty-one countries left remain. So the next coming country that will be Ghana. Thank you very much for listening. No, the next coming country that will be Gambia. Thank you very much for listening. I will catch you up with the next episode. Thank you once again. Bye for now.